it was challenging at times, but it's something, it's a dream that an artist would want to do. You know, we'll say Aufstein because we're in Germany, which means to go up. And so you have the stunt guy. Hi, Will. <laughs> hey, how are you? I'm doing fine in you. Good, good. Doing yes. well. Before we talk about Constellation, I need to salute you on the 1001. I love you as Lucky. And mm -hmm. you're amazing on that movie. <laughs> thank you oh, so thank much you. for that, for that performance. I love oh, it. Oh, thank you. Yes. Yeah, so, okay. Constellation. Oh, my God. What we can expect of Paul from the, from the remaining of the episodes? Well, um, Paul goes on a real emotional roller coaster that I think a lot of the view viewers can identify with. And so his story will begin to unravel around episode 106. And, you know, not to give too much away, but Paul and Joe kind of have the same story, you know, just in, uh, <laughs> you know, a different universe, so to speak. And, you know, the experiment that I'm working on uh, with Henry is able to do some amazing things and then we look forward to continuing to tell that story yeah it's amazing and uh i think it's it's a a big a, a little bit of a challenge because i don't want to give away because you you in different timelines yeah but how was that challenge for you on set to play this 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 story about paul well it's a lot of times we're just leaning into the director saying okay what reality are we in are we in Paul A or Paul B? And, um, but also when you're in it, you're in it, you know? And the material that Peter wrote, it allows you not to think as much just to be able to react. And, you know, what connects humans is the emotion. You know, how do you deal with grief? How do you deal with regret? How you deal with letting go? How you deal with moving on? Because letting go and moving on are two different things. I can let go of a relationship but I may not have moved on in my mind. You know what I'm saying? So those things that Peter is really like uh, the conductor playing on the human experience. Yeah, this series is so intense. And, you know, it's a drama, it's a sci-fi, it's a trailer, it's a conspiracy, yeah. it's yeah, everything. Yeah. And every episode you have questions and then you have answers. And it's so amazing. How is it for you like to be part of something that is so mix it up, you know what I mean? Like something, it's great. I love the series, so. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, when I was having dinner in Berlin with Michelle, our director, and Joseph and Peter, who Joseph's our other director, I told him, I said, we're gonna win everything. We're winning every award, we're winning everything because it, everything is there to, to gather. But the thing that I wanted to say, the most exciting thing for me, sitting in the movie theaters, screening constellation was the people next to me jumping scared frightened laughing crying and i was like oh yes it's working it's working it's working and so as an artist that is the biggest reward that one can get yeah it's amazing and and uh you might have answered the question before of uh well working performing zero gravity how was that experience <laughs> It was challenging at times, but it's something, it's a dream that an artist would want to do. You know, we'll say Aufstein because we're in Germany, which means to go up. And so you have the stunt guy, you know, on the rig and they're rigging you up and you're, you're hovering, you know, off of the ground and you're doing your lines and, you know, you have to make sure that's right. So Scott Kelly, who's a real astronaut, you know, he was there to teach us how to move throughout the ISS. And then you have an exact replica that we're working in of the real ISS that's in space. So you have all this different elements in the environment working for you. So it's easy just to play and lean into the role and lean into the work. And then how's work with Numi? Oh, she's Numi. Amazing. Not only is Numi amazing, not only is she brilliant, she's such a generous actor. And she brought it every single day. And that's what I really love about her. And she's stylish and she's fine. You know, let's not... <laughs> You know, so she's easy on the eye for Paul because I think Paul has a secret thing for for Joe. But that's just me as an as an artist. But yeah, she, you know, one thing that you're gonna get from Numi Rapace is you're gonna get all of her, and I love that. And she she requires 
whoever's working alongside her to bring the game up another step. And that's always amazing. Amazing. And before we go, uh, you're in the movie Abigail that is going to premiere soon. Is there anything that you can tease us about the movie? Be one of the best scary movies you've ever seen. <laughs> it's, and it's crazy and we shot in Ireland for three months and the cast is amazing a cast of misfits who come together to you know complete a heist that we'll see how it ends amazing well I just want to thank you so much for your time cannot wait to watch the remain of the episodes yes. of Constellation and keep bringing in uh, like amazing projects that you're in to us and thank you so much for your time Thank you. And thank you for watching me and loving me. I appreciate it. Of course. Bye. Thank you. Bye. If you like to support or continue to support Journal Camera, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share the videos.